What's up guys, welcome back to the LD world. It's your boy Lance here with another video. We actually have Dua participating with us today. Of course, long distance. Um, go ahead and say what's up, boo. Hello. <laughs> I don't know why she had to be all weird about it. Go ahead and tell them what we're doing today, babe. I'm going to ask Len some questions about Iceland, the language, just anything related to Iceland and see how Icelandic he is. Yeah. Which, as you can tell um, by some of our recent videos or some of the videos that we posted before, I am very, very Icelandic, so this is gonna be a walk in the park. But before we get started, you guys know what to do. Make sure to give the video a big thumbs up, subscribe to our channel if you're not already, hit the notification bell if you want to be notified every time we upload, which is every other day. But without further ado, let's just jump right into the video. <laughs> so that every other day thing, I still don't know if I got it right. I'm over here like karate chopping every time we do it. I don't think you got it right. Are you ready? Yeah, let's do it. Let's okay. test my Icelandic skills. Here we go. Question number one is... How do you say Iceland in Icelandic? Super easy. Iceland. <laughs> How did you know that? Because I'm pretty much Icelandic. Let's go. We're knocking them out. Oh my gosh. I was not expecting you to know that. Okay, what's the average temperature for Icelandic summer? In, in Fahrenheit or Celsius? Celsius, but you don't know that, so. Yeah, I try to make it seem like I did, but I don't know Celsius at all. So we're gonna do it in Fahrenheit and you gotta, you gotta like translate it into Celsius. Yeah, tell me, cause I'm gonna Google it. Okay, in Fahrenheit, the average temperature in Iceland is anywhere from, can I do like a 10 degree difference? Yes. No, nah, that's cheating. I'll do like a five degree difference. Okay. So what the is average temperature in Iceland and Fahrenheit is about 40 degrees. Um, she's gonna tell you guys what it is in so Celsius. I Googled the question just to make sure. And it says the average July temperature in the Southern part of Iceland is 50 to 55 Fahrenheit. I knew it. I was gonna say that, but I what wanted to make say? it seem like 40. it was colder. Yeah, I said 40. I think that's that's. I think that that's Google's way of of saying. I think it really is like 40 to be honest. Wait, what? What is 50 average? To 55? This is that's average. I think a third. good day for you guys is 50 to 55, but average, I would say about 40. I don't know. I think the average is like 50, 55. So I don't think you're correct on that one. <laughs> I guess I can't be right on all of them. Okay, the next one is, how many highways or like main roads do we have in Iceland? Two. Wrong, we have one. <laughs> I knew it, I knew it, I was gonna say one. Yeah, I'm going with my have... gut feeling from now on. From now on, I'm going with my gut. The main road is around the island. So that, that one road takes you around the island? Yeah, that's like the only highway that we have. All the other ones are like, what do you call it? Just, just, just like regular roads. roads. Yeah. So there goes a fun fact for you guys. Iceland only has one main highway that takes them around the entire island. And how, how long does it take to get around the entire island? Like if you want to do a road trip of Iceland. I think if you drive um, without any stop, it's like 14 hours. That's not bad at all. It took me, what, about 20 hours to get from Oklahoma to Florida? And of course I stopped, I had to stop in between, so. Yeah. That's not bad at all. You can do, you can literally do, with a couple of stops, just to use the bathroom, cause she has to use the bathroom like every five seconds. But with a couple <laughs> of stops, you can probably do a whole road trip of Iceland in one day. We should test that out. Yeah, we should. That's gonna be the longest road that's gonna be the longest one day ever <laughs> i don't know if me and dua we do well together but i don't know if we do well together in a car no i don't think so because we don't listen to the same music we don't know mention one icelandic music band <laughs> 
You know this. Yeah, I don't know, like, the only problem is, is I don't know, like, names of bands, period. American, Icelandic, it doesn't matter. Um, but Really? Yeah, but there's a song, because I remember we was walking around Disney one day, and there's a song that we were singing. It was like, oh, that's the Icelandic band. Oh, gosh, this is going to kill me. We have three that's very well known, like outside Iceland. And that is one of them, well, two of them you don't know, which is Björk. You probably don't know it. Then Sigurós. Still don't know. Can, can you sing a song? She won't. And, and the, no, no, no. <laughs> she won't. And the third one that you're talking about is Of Monsters and Men. The what? Of Monsters and Men. You know Ah, you know, yeah, I, song. I think I know that. Yeah. Look look up the songs, because she won't sing it for us, and I don't know it. Okay, are you ready for the next one? It's about a TV show. Funny thing is, before we go on, actually, this one is about the song and TV show. I want you guys to look on Netflix, and Will Ferrell and Amy McAdams is coming out with a show called, I think it's like Eurovision, and they're Icelandic singers. I want to watch that with you. I think that'll be fun. Yeah, they were just advertising the, in the on the TV. And it looks Iceland. absolutely hilarious. And I think they probably filmed it in Iceland, a lot of the places. Yeah, they did. Yeah. So, Iceland's coming up. Okay, so this is about a, a kid show. So, like, for kids. Okay. The question is, what well-known kid show about living a healthy life is Icelandic? I don't know the name of the show, but it's like... They're like puppets, and there's like a human guy, and he and then the bad guy has a long mustache, a long mustache. How did you know that? Because I remember you said he's like your neighbor. Yes. Yeah. What's the name of the show? Lazy Town. Lazy Town. Look up Lazy Town. The muscly rip guy is do his neighbor. Well, he's not my neighbor anymore, but. He lives in, he used to live in my hometown. Yeah, and their hometown is really small, so they're basically neighbors. But I guess he lives in the States now. <laughs> and um, no, it, it was super nice cool. Family. Like, Lazy Town's actually a pretty good, I mean, I'm old and I watched it. I'm not going to tell anybody how no, old I am yet. It's a really good show. It's a really good show. It was for a kid's show. I would let my kids watch it. Yeah. Especially with the kid's show that goes on today. Oh, goodness. What's next? The next one you should no okay what is you know who the mountain is yeah game of thrones okay what is his name is it B B bjorn the his like actual name his full name i don't know his full name but is his first name like bjorn no that's his last name he's his beard son wait you already said it no, 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 that was his last name, but what is his actual name? Remember the other day I sent you a video of him, like, trying for Yeah, the deadlift. deadlift. Yeah. Oh my gosh, this is killing me. I know <laughs> it too. Maybe you haven't heard his name, I don't know. What is it? Hold on, I might sneeze. I'm not gonna sneeze. What is it? Hafthor Julius. I did not know that. I thought his name was Bjorn. Or maybe I just yeah. like the name Bjorn because it's from Vikings and that's one of my favorite characters. But yeah. I thought his name was Bjorn this whole time. What is it? Hata Nules? Hafthor. Haf. Hafthor. 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 I'm sorry, bro. I am butchering the name. <laughs> I'm still learning Icelandic. The next one is really easy. Okay. Oh, I hope so. Because the, the questions definitely got harder from the first one because I got them all wrong. <laughs> what is the main religion in Iceland? Surprisingly, it's Christianity. Yes. Yeah. Iceland was founded back in um, 15 BC and um, what's his name? Floki decided to bring Christianity over from Norway and that's how that happened. Really? No, not at all. Why did you say really this is your country? I no, I was just I was listening to the story and I was like, what is he saying? Oh my gosh, you don't know how. Let's go to the next question. What month in Iceland is daylight 
What month in Iceland is daylight 24 seven? Is it one month or two? It's just one month. Well, June. Yeah. Yay. June, because she said that in the Insta story, in the <laughs> Insta story, <laughs> Insta story the other day. June is 24 <laughs> hours of daylight. She'll show some videos or some clips either here or in our story, and it is absolutely beautiful. Do you know what date is the longest day? So, is it in June? Yes, obviously. June 24th. Oh, you're close. Dang it. So, the longest day is 21st of June, and the shortest day is 21st of December. That is when we only have daylight like one hour. Word. Yeah. I was there in December. I think on the 21st. You came for New Year's. You didn't, you weren't here on. Oh, Christmas. yeah, you're right. But it still yeah. messed my brain up. I, t tell them the story. Your parents thought I was lazy because yeah. I slept so much? Yeah, I was, I, I woke up at like 6 a.m. and left. <laughs> and I'm and sitting there watching morning. Netflix, like, hey, good morning. No, no, no. You were talking to your mom at 6 a.m. <laughs> oh, yeah. I was like, what is he doing? Why is he awake? I could not sleep. I couldn't sleep for the life of me. But when everybody else in the house woke up is when I slept. Remember when you when you went for a walk with my mom? <sighs> yes, I remember <laughs> when I went for a walk. I was covered. Literally, the only thing you could see is my eyes. I was like this. Uh, yeah. What's the next question? Okay, okay. The last question. I taught you this the other day. How do you say, do you want water in Icelandic? This is why, this is why you have to say these <laughs> things to me over and over and over again. <sighs> All right, I'm not gonna disappoint you. Um, you know how to say water? Yes, water is va. Yeah. Yes, yes, you said it, yeah, vatnit. Vatnith. That's the water, but water is not. Yeah, it's fine. Yeah. Um, I really don't remember. It's one word. Is it like, I want to say something like day or de or da. That's, that's the days. Or do, do a. No, okay, I'll tell you. And I'm going to ask you another question because you failed on that one. Okay. Um. How is she going to expect me to get something like that? That's not even in the English language. Viftu. No, viftu. Remember, I Vift. told you that. Viftu. And then bath. If you go to Iceland and you want to ask somebody if they want water for some strange reason, you say viftu va. <laughs> I swear, Icelandic is the hardest language I've ever tried to learn. Before we close the video off, Okay. Tell them the days in Icelandic. She's trying to make fun of me, y'all. Monday is... Manadagur? Yes. Tuesday is... Thriftidagur? No. I just stuttered. How do you say it? Tridi Dagur. I was close. Yeah. Wednesday is my favorite one. Mini Dicka Dagur. <laughs> Thursday is Thursday Dagur. No, it's not Thursday Dagur. It's. I can't. I can never remember Thursday. Fimti Dagur. Fimti Friday is. Luna Dagur. No, that's. Am I mixing languages? Am I mixing like Spanish and. Or am I just making yeah. up my own words? I mean, I'm I making up my own words. That, that's not Spanish, but um, first it out. It's Friday. But the funny thing about is, this is, is two years ago when she was actually teaching me Icelandic, I knew the days of the week like the back of my hand. Then so she completely happened? stopped. She completely stopped teaching me Icelandic. I don't need to teach you. If I already. If I already taught you, you need to keep up with it. You need that is to... not true because we stopped and she started teaching me Spanish. So I completely lost all of my Icelandic. Because, I mean, we were living in Spain. I needed to know Spanish. 
Okay, finish the... the I don't know the rest. <laughs> What's Saturday and Sunday? I can't remember. I can't remember at all. Lager dog good. And soon. Yeah, I was gonna say that. Soon to talk it. Next time we do this whole Icelandic challenge thing, I guarantee you I'm gonna have the days of the week down. She's gonna ask me that every time and put me on the spot. But it's tough. That was it for this video, guys. We hope you enjoyed it. Let us know in the comments down below. Wait, who am I? Who am I? That was it for this video, guys. We hope you enjoyed it. Let us know in the comments down below. Let us know in the comments down below what your favorite Icelandic word was or some of the fun facts that you've learned to hit the thumbs up button. If you like the video, subscribe to the channel because we subscribe to life and turn on that noti bell because we got videos coming for you. Let me see. Every other day. I think I got it that time. And we'll see you guys in a couple of days. Later dudes.